Yep, it's been a while and I'm back. I'm super excited about the future and that's what this channel is gonna be about. I'm gonna talk about future tech, future things that are happening in the world and trends that I see that are interesting for all of you guys out there and most of all for me. Okay, the new product from Apple and no, it's not the iPhone 14. As you probably saw in the last week, they have launched uh, basically new iPhones and a new Apple Watch. The iPhones are uh-uh, the Apple Watch seem really, really cool. However, in the very end of that presentation, where most people logged out, they clicked away from the video or the live stream, wherever you watched it, then something super duper interested happened. Look at this. And that made me thinking, like, why are they showing a girl standing waiting at the subway station for no reason? So I looked into a few different sources and I found this. Yeah, I found that Apple is actually getting into AR. It's been rumors for a long, long time. But placing that in their official video, 2022, I mean, that really shows that something really cool really soon is happening. So what the patents show is that they are looking into mixed reality. AR and VR together. So what they wanted to create is probably something uh, that's covering your eyes. Either it's a pair of glasses, or it's like the ski goggles, or it's the full screen that you put that you put in front of your eyes. And uh, there are a few prototypes. Of, and of course, people try to design the future product of Apple. And this one, I really, really think is cool. I really hope that they're launching this and doing this in a very good way because mixed reality is something that all the big tech companies are really really investing in heavily because before like a year ago it was meta metaverse people always try to create that 3d worlds but do you really want to have those screens in front of you all the time don't you want to have the reality and a few things that's like added to it like augmented i.e argumented reality so that is a super duper cool product there are very few details with this though it's very very few details uh, they have a few patterns that they show okay how would that look like how would people interact because if you're not using your phone if you're not using um, yeah some touchpad or anything like how can you control a VR AR XR environment is that with your voice and Honestly, I don't use Siri very much and I don't know if you do, but should you only talk to the goggles or should you have a device where you can actually move it? And that's what made me even more interested in these patterns because what you can see is that Apple is looking into gloves. They're looking into gloves so you can create a feeling in the gloves when you're touching different yeah, materials or whatever, you could feel that a material in your hand without actually touching it. That's that's one thing. Another thing that they're also patenting is to actually use your clothes as a touchpad. Yes, you heard it right. It's actually by like putting things in your clothes. They're like threads that you're putting in your clothes and then you can actually have your, I don't know, your, your arm as a trackpad or whatever where you can control. And that connected to the AR VR glasses, the XR as they're calling it, that would be such an awesome future. That's a very quick update. These videos shouldn't be too long, but I'm so glad that I'm back and I hope you are glad as well that I'm back. Hope you enjoy this video. My name is Magnus Detmar and I'll see you in the next one.